Brahmos is a most uh, potent uh, weapon in the inventory of uh, Indian armed forces. Uh, we have uh, made a completely new weapon system, Brahmos, uh, in the 2005 onwards. And uh, this missile is a very, very credible missile. Uh, the range of this missile is 300 kilometer plus. Uh, the missile can be integrated to warships, uh, land systems, submarine, and uh, fighter aircraft like uh, Sukhoi 30 MKI. And uh, this uh, missile is having a weight of about uh, 2.8 uh, ton. Uh, the length around uh, 10 meters and uh, we can have uh, the range 300 and uh, plus kilometers. Uh, the warhead uh, is around again uh, 300 and plus. Destructive capability of the missile is uh, arrived uh, because of the energy of the missile, kinetic energy, because the missile flies at the speed of 2.8 Mach. That is three times, almost three times the speed of sound and uh, which can be converted to around 900 uh, meters per second. Uh, just to make you understand the speed, uh, this is twice the speed of a bullet uh, which we shoot in the air. And uh, this missile is uh, uh, in heavy demand all over the place. Uh, we have uh, supplied it to our all the three armed forces. Uh, quite in numbers, large numbers, and uh, we have also exported the missile to Philippines. Uh, there are many more countries who want this missile, uh, Indonesia, Vietnam, Middle East, uh, Africa, and uh, South Africa. What makes the missile in so much demand is the credible performance of this missile system. Uh, the missile we have tested for more than 130 plus and uh, every time the missile has uh, performed, maneuvered and hit the target as per the plan. And uh, the another thing which makes the missile very potent is its stealth. The missile is having a, a pencil shape. The missile is made up of uh, composite the missile is also uh, having the sections uh, which uh, doesn't reflect the radar, incoming radar waves. And uh, apart from this, the speed of the missile is so high uh, that uh, the radars, surface radars and uh, the air defense system of the adversary, they don't find it uh, possible to catch this missile. That is why this missile is uh, indefeatable and uh, in great demand all over the place. Uh, I would like to share one more important thing about this missile is the missile can have variety of trajectories. It is like a pilotless aircraft. Uh, you can uh, fly it up to 14 kilometers altitude. Uh, you can fly it up to the 10 meters altitude over surface of water. You, because of the variety of trajectories, again, it becomes very difficult for adversary to detect it. Another thing about this missile is, this is a universal missile. The universal missile, it means it is replaceable to any of the platforms of the missile. So the maintenance becomes much easier. Availability of the components becomes much easier. And uh, that's how we have inducted the system into all the three services. And uh, this missile uh, has uh, created uh, huge uh, fear and uh, helplessness uh, in the minds uh, of our uh, adversary. The BrahMos missile has been delivered to the users in the operational stage. Uh, what it means is that our users, Indian Army, Indian Navy and Indian Air Force can deploy and uh, within days they can start using it. And uh, we are very proud that uh, our, all the three services, uh, they are uh, using it to meet their various uh, operational requirements. Yesterday, uh, Defense Minister of India and uh, Chief Minister of Uttar Pradesh, uh, they have inaugurated a uh, new facility of uh, BrahMos uh, Aerospace at Lucknow. Uh, we already had uh, integration and manufacturing facilities at uh, Hyderabad, uh, Tiruvananthapuram, Nagpur and Pilani. This new facility at Lucknow uh, would meet the increased demand of Indian armed forces and uh, export 
Apart from this, uh, we also have undertaken the design, development, manufacturing of uh, BrahMos uh, NG. NG stands for uh, new generation. The missile BrahMos NG uh, would be much lighter in the weight. Uh, it would be about uh, 1,200 kilograms. And uh, uh, the range is going to be similar. That is up to 300 kilometers. And again, we are making the new BrahMos NG uh, universal so that it can be used by Indian Army, Navy, and Air Force and can be exported to any friendly nation. Uh, this missile, BrahMos NG, uh, would be using state-of-the-art technologies and uh, miniaturized version of uh, main BrahMos. Uh, we are looking forward in the time duration of 12 to 18 months to come up with the first prototype of uh, this missile, which we will be testing and uh, we will be uh, then going to the users to buy it in numbers. So uh, another uh, a hugely strong and uh, a different uh, missile would be in the inventory of our armed forces quite soon. Thank you.